ไงสหาย What's up guys Abzu here for another video um, This time I'm trying out Street Fighter 6 I've been waiting for this game for a long time now um, I'm hoping you guys enjoy it too uh, I'm, Today I'm just gonna be learning Manon for the first time um, Haven't touched this game at all This is my first experience I mean I did do the tutorial but I haven't touched Manon at all So I'm gonna learn how to play her and hope you guys enjoy it. Manon is a well-rounded character with quick ballet balletic. Is that a word? Balletic? Balletic. Balletic. Kicks that let her dictate the flow of a match and powerful judo throws that she can use to break through someone's guard once she's closed in. All right. When vying for position, Make use of the varying ranges of Manon's kick attacks to poke your opponent. And once you're sufficiently restricted their movements with anti-air attacks, look for opportunities to close in on them. All right. Once you've gained some ground, use combination attacks to draw your opponent towards you and then throw them so you can deal damage. Raise your metal level and keep your pressure going. All right. Romverse is a highly versatile is highly versatile, useful both in combos or when using its follow-up as a poke. All right. Manage Dore. All right. Grab your opponent at close range, disrupt their balance, and toss them to the ground with a powerful throw. Landing this move will raise your metal level, and the move's effective uh, moves effects will change depending on that level. All right. Ah uh, yes, this is a throw most lovely indeed. It includes a step forward before the throw, giving it exquisite range. It is simply fantastic. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> For slipping through an opponent's guard up close or at mid range. All right. Am I gonna play at some point? Oh my god. Okay, here we go. I was supposed to click something before. All right. All right. So forward, backwards, punch. All right. Hmm. Hmm. So wait, am I able to go back? Okay, so forward, backwards. Alright. Alright. She is so beautiful. Look at her. <laughs> I love this color. Wait a minute. Alright. So... Turn to previous explanation. Am I able to try these out? Oh yeah, I am. Let me do all this first. All right. Wait. Play from the beginning. What? All right. All right, all right, all right. Let me try this again. <laughs> How to play Manon, basic info. Am I able to try this out? Oh no, alright. Uh, yes. This move, okay wait. Previous explanation, okay. Your metal level can go up to 5 and doesn't reset between rounds. Perform as many throws as you can so, the, so that you might keep the match moving in your favor. Okay. Overdrive. Opt for the overdrive version. Alright, so forward. Wait, so do I press... OD Menage Dore! So... Have to press both of these or something? There we go, yeah. Alright. Make good use of it so that you may raise your metal level. Alright. Rom point something. A swift upwards kick performed while spinning. Useful in combos or if done early as an anti-air attack. Excellent against jumping opponents. 
The light and medium ones are fast, making your primary anti, making it your primary anti-air choice. But should you react quickly, landing the heavy one, heavy one, will allow you to do a follow-up afterwards. All right. So. Ooh. All right. All right. Ooh. Oh my gosh, she is so pretty. What the fuck? All right. When you're using it a combo, you want to do it from light attacks. If you're up close, if your opponent more up close, likely to keep their guard tight, making throws more effective. Oh my gosh, she's so cool. All right. It will launch your opponent into the air if it hits, making follow up child's play. Alright. Oops. Oops. Okay, this is a kick, this is a punch. Okay, so I have to go. Alright, there we go. Okay. Yes. Degage. 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 Uh, a powerful thrusting kick performed with all the grace of ballet, useful for catching opponents by surprise and slipping through their guard. The behavior of this move differs b depending on the strength of the button used. Light has you move forward with a low attack that cannot be blocked standing. It is quite useful as a surprise against distant opponents. This does come with its wrists, okay. Medium is best used in combos. I imagine. It is quite useful for combos for media, medium attacks or as follow-up attacks. Alright. Okay, so that's Degage. Okay. Alright, so this is the flying, leaping, beautiful one, and then this is the spinning on the floor on her vagina. Jesus Christ! She's really just twirling on the floor. What the hell? Jesus. All right. Okay. So next, heavy performs an overhead that cannot be blocked crouching. All right. So wait, heavy. Heavy is okay. So, backwards kick, heavy kick, backwards medium kick, alright, backwards low kick, alright. Romverse. Spin towards your opponent and grab them before sending them flying. Landing this move will raise your metal level, and the move's effects will change depending on that level. Converse, alright. So... Oh, okay, so if you hold it, you pretend like you're gonna do it. Alright. The light and medium versions will connect from heavy attacks with little difficulty, but you'll need to find a sufficient opening if you are to land the devastating heavy version. Connect from attacks following a dry brush may prove easiest. All right. Oh. Okay, so. Oh, shit. All right, so. What about heavy? What the fuck is that? <laughs> All right. And should you hold the button while performing it, you will move without attacking, producing a faint. 
It can be used to advance through. Ooh, what the fuck? So you could just dodge shit. That's nice. So she could literally just dodge things. All right. Interesting. Ah, uh, one more thing. If you press a kick before the attack executes, it will change to a kicking move called the Grand Foe. Foe. It boasts incredible reach and you can perform a follow-up should it connect. Use it to check your opponent from afar. Alright. Okay. Oh, alright. Oh, so like, she could like, she could like dodge, she could like dodge a projectile and then kick. That's cool. What about heavy kick? Okay. You will be able to evade any attack not aimed at your feet. Okay. Overdrive. So, overdriving it. That's like her main attack. All right, so you like. She has really good buttons, just normally. All right. All right. Should the enemy not attempt to attack you? It would be best to switch to a faint. Also, you'll be able to follow Grand Foe with more moves than you would normally. So should an opponent be left open, use it to perform as devastating a combo as possible. All right, well, that's never gonna happen. Let's see. to be wait it's supposed to be I can interrupt it with a kick right whatever kudos have reached the required amount savage swan Ooh. arabesque a kick perform of sliding forward along the ground that sends your opponent flying invincible on startup all right this move can be used to switch places with your opponent. Oh. Provided you hit from close enough. So it's invincible, alright. So. Alright. Et toi. Etoile, or I don't know. Launch your opponent into the air with a quick 1-2 combination of kicks and follow up with a powerful leaping kick. This move executes quickly, making it useful as an anti-air attack or as a way to com combo airborne opponents. It's swift, making it useful in both combos and as an anti-air attack. Okay. Shine like the star you are. <laughs> Alright. My husband's looking at me like I'm crazy. <laughs> Pass de du, 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 do, whatever. Attack as though performing a ballet dance and then smash your opponent onto the ground with a devastating slam. Can be used to slip through an opponent's guard at close range and deal tons of damage all at once. All right. A highly artistic throw. This, this could be considered akin to a dance duet in ballet. It is, its damage is truly magnifique. <laughs> what is so do all you can to land it when it counts most. My god. Alright. When near the opponent. Bup, bup, bup. Wait. 
Doot doot. Oh my goodness. Doot doot. There we go. Oh my god, I love this bitch. <laughs> Fundamentals 1, alright? What you mu must understand is that my style revolves around beautiful and precise movements. As such, it is of utmost importance that moves be performed efficiently. To begin, yes, let's have you memorize ways to check your opponent. Okay. Medium attacks are likely the easiest to use for that purpose. Crouching medium punch is suitable for defeating your opponent's own pokes, and standing medium punch moves you forward, making it a wonderful way to attack and approach all at once. All right. Another fine choice would be your standing medium kick. Okay. <laughs> uh, da, 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 da. Should you choose to engage with a heavy attack, make use of your far-reaching standing heavy attack. All right. It leaves you quite open, but it's easy to connect. Okay. Oh, wait, 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 wait. All right, uh, okay. Heavy attack, and then medium, okay. She's so pretty, oh my god. All right. Character Explorer. Okay. Fundamental 2. Judo teaches us the, that the key to victory lies in responding to your opponent's offense with flexibility. Alright. Followed up with an allonge to bring them crashing back to the ground. Okay. Crouching heavy punch. Damn, I'm getting destroyed. Oh, oh, oh my god, what? <laughs> oh, am I am I pressing the right button? Oh my god. All right. Oh my goodness. Am I crazy? <laughs> Oh my god! Oh, finally! Oh my goodness. Oh my... That takes some crazy timing. Oh, there we go. Oh my god. Let's try that again. Ooh, there we go. Alright. Yeah, bitch! Okay. <laughs> Let's go back. Uh, should someone jump at you? Yeah, okay. If special moves are your forte, there's also Ron Bon. Point. It's a tad more difficult to pull off than a crouching heavy punch, but it's wonderfully effective should you manage it. Alright. I'm probably gonna think this one's easier. Drive parries, okay. Advanced one. Once you grasp the basics, okay. Alright. On the halt. Okay, medium kick. Okay, so medium kick. So I have to hit him with this. Three BM. All right. Okay. Advance two. Take the fight to your opponent. Taking is a fine way. Okay. It's also possible to bring your opponents into range when you grab them. Okay. Let's begin with tom tompsle tom tom or some shit, which can be done from a standing heavy punch. All right. So this is heavy punch, and then you bring them in. All right. Uh, 
but be forewarned. If blocked, you will be open to getting counter attack. Only perform it after confirming the standy heavy punch. All right. Next we have Ah uh, Tere Tere, which is done from a standing medium punch. This move is so swift that you can use it to counter even the smallest of an opponent's openings. All right. So medium kick, no medium punch then medium kick. So. All right. Should an opponent attempt to check you with an attack and miss, seize the opportunity to turn things in your favor. Okay. We finished all of that shit, finally. Let's try one game <laughs> against an AI and see what happens. Commentary settings on. Oh, I love that. That has like, that has like commentators like from esports tournaments speaking as you play. Like, they try to hype you up or, like, say stuff that's happening in the game. Okay. Player one, alright. Next up, stage selection. Oh, see that? They're talking. Alright. Let's do the New York City map, basically. Let's see who our fighters choose. CPU. I also love Jamie, so let's see how he plays. Let's let's watch me get my ass kicked. All right, by CPU. <laughs> Oh, we got his amazing theme song. All right. All right first oh, oh, oh. oh, Jesus. Oh, oh, uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, jeez. All right. You bitch. Oh, oh. Uh-uh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh. oh no. Ooh, bitch! Yes! Haha. <laughs> Let's go. Oh. Oh. Ha, get dodged, bitch. Oh god, the lag has come to this game too. That was a clinic on how a solid neutral game wins match. Yes. Alright guys. <laughs> Thanks for watching. <laughs>